complicated. And so I, you know, I, I don't want to belabor this. It's it, we're we're in the, we're in the first week of the season, and I don't want to start talking about rule changes or whatever. This was a known problem. This was a problem that happened late last season, and, and nothing was done to fix it. And uh, clearly, the solution is to do an NFL fantasy style situation where you can change squads before every you, you can you can change your lineup or burn points to bring in somebody or whatever uh, before every match kicks off that is and then everybody gets an equal playing field and I mean there's this idea that somehow 90 minutes is fair for everybody but it clearly isn't right it's there's a huge edge to people who are getting these team sheet leaks um, and so I guess my point here Brandon is I want the leaks too OK, if you're listening to this podcast and you are a um, you're a cl- you're, you're at a club or you work for Sky Sports or BBC or whatever, uh, if you have an in at a club, you share them, share them with your buddy, Josh, the host. OK, at this point, I, I, and here's what I'll say. I'll be democratic about it, Brandon. OK, mm-hmm. or I'll be open mm-hmm. when I get those leaks. I promise to share them. OK, unless the person leaking doesn't want me to. But in general, if you give it to me, I'm getting that out into the world. OK, <laughs> I there's the cheaters are and they're not even cheating exactly. But the people who are getting like the equivalent of like insider trading are, are winning right now. And I want to be a winner, too. OK, I don't want to sit here and bemoan it. I just want to start cheating as well. It's like it's like this is why people cheat in their taxes because they see they see other they see billionaires cheating their taxes. Like, why am I not cheating to my taxes the way they are? And so oh I want I want to cheat. I want to cheat on my taxes, too. I want people to leak clean sheet uh, team information and then we will share that on twitter we'll share it on our discord we will get the word out to you the listener okay let's let's even the playing fields by by let's let's push this cheating as far as we can go is what i'm saying let's push it so far that the game has no choice to either you know what i don't think it's going to change so why 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 don't we just lean into it give us the information and always cheating we'll share it with everybody, okay? <laughs> we'll share it far. We'll share it wide, okay? Yeah. We're going to get that information out. We're going to level that playing field. If we have people in Australia, you know what? Let's do push notifications, okay? We'll start sending push notifications out to you. Yeah, put the you sound on, on the push notification. Put the sound on. Always che- yeah, exactly. exactly. You can so pop up. You, up. <laughs> you can see the always cheating push notification. <laughs> ah, okay, great. Now I've got to go. Uh, i got to go make this change. So mm-hmm. give, give us this information. If you don't have it yourself, you tell us someone who does and we'll reach out to them. Okay? So we're going we're gonna to make this happen. I refuse to let one single account dictate Ever like, like that one single account and, and their viewers dictate who gets the inside scoop. Okay. I want a more democratic playing field. Okay. These, the, the leaks should always be taken with a grain of salt, but I have to say they're usually pretty accurate. The kind of leaks that, that are like good enough to share. Wouldn't you say like nine times out of 10, they actually turn out to be true. Like they're, it, they're, they're pretty consistently accurate. The ones that, that leak out. I'm, I'm not entirely sure if it's that or if it's a wisdom of the crowds thing where in particular Twitter, uh, everyone's paying attention and they've sniffed out the, oh, the last time this person quote unquote leaked a lineup, it was wrong. So we don't trust them. So when the leaks that start getting shared are the ones that people historically trust. So I I do feel like a lot of the ones that spread tend to be the ones that are pre-vetted, you know, the, the accounts anyway. That's right. And you block the wind up merchants. So I am being completely serious. I'm not being facetious at all. We want the leaks and then we're going to share them with people (laughs) because (laughs) I'm not going to go through a whole season being left out the way I was this game week. Okay. I want in and I'm going to keep talking about this until people start (laughs) to send us via DM, by email. I don't care what it is. You share those leaks with us and we're going to get the information out there. I am not joking. Okay. So there's where we are. That's the leak drama. Josh Landon is all in on insider trading. 